Hello everyone, here in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can shift these thumbnail images to the left side. So basically in the default theme, it looks like this. The thumbnail images are in the bottom, but I am interested to move them to the left hand side. And you can see that these are scrolling uh, from top to bottom. And you can also select these images from here. And so let me quickly show you that how I did this. So the first thing is that you should go to the dashboard of the store and here you can see that we have installed down theme. If you have any other theme, then still this feature will work. So you can try it. If you face any issue, you can ask me, I will help you out in solving this. You can ask me, I will help you out in solving this. So firstly, you should click on these three dots and duplicate this theme so that later on, if you have any problem or something, you can roll it back to its original version. Once you duplicate it, then you should click on edit code. And here we have some folders and files. So you should uh, search here CSS file and uh, basically in your theme it might be different css file for, uh, for example for in this case we have base.css and uh, there can be theme.css style.css or maybe main.css so whichever css you have you can open it up and scroll to the bottom once you are scrolling to the bottom then you should uh, write here some css code so let me quickly show you how you can do that so in our case if i am refreshing this page you can see that the images are showing at the bottom all right in other products also if i am selecting this product you can see in the bottom we have all these images showing and for say example i am checking this product so in the same way all those images are in the bottom so how we can put them or maybe move them to the left hand side so that's what we have the purpose of this th uh, video so that's what we are going to do it. So that's what we are going to do here. So I have already written a code. So you need to copy and paste that code. So here we have that code. I'm going to copy this complete code. And then you need to go back to the dashboard. So here we have base.css. So at the bottom, I'm going to paste this code and then click on save. Once the changes are saved, then you can actually go back and for example, I was testing the product, which was uh, this one, maybe, uh, sorry, this one. And now you can see that we have all those images in the left hand side. But now the problem is that uh, these images are uh, showing little bit down. So how we can move little bit up because the main image is not uh, much bigger. So you have the option here to adjust these sizes. So here is the width which is thumbnail list width so you can increase the width and it will actually decrease the number of items so for say example i am adding 20 and let me save these changes and then refresh this page now you can see that number of images are a little bit reduced but we need to reduce the width also so for say example this is the width of uh, small images so right now i am going to put here 500 pixel so let me save the changes and let me refresh this page again. Here we go. Now you can see, see that the design is quite balanced because uh, the images are in the center and bigger images is also looking beautiful. So the slider is also working. So we have actually these small arrows to move the images up and down. So that's how you can actually implement this feature into your store. If you have any problem or something, you can ask me directly. I will help you out in solving that problem. So in some cases, you want these uh, small images to be uh, circular. So I have already implemented that code also. So here is something which I implemented before. So let me show you. So this is actually the border radius. So if you are refreshing this page, you will see that all these images are now circular. All right. So this is also looking beautiful. So you, if you wanted to make them like this, so that you can also implement into your store. But I have already created the uh, video for this feature. So you can follow that video and you can implement the same thing into your store. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you are new on this channel, then please subscribe this channel. Also like this video. If you if you have any issue or something, you can directly contact me. I will 
I have already given the contact details below in the description. You can follow me on Instagram, Facebook and TikTok. You can also join a WhatsApp group which I have created. So in most of the cases, I uh, add a lot of new content in the, those groups. So you can follow. So you can join all of them. So thank you so much once again. See you in the next video.